fun. It was it was full of Hong Kong action and, and gods disappearing and zapping one another. There was a huge chance taken in saying that we're going to make this about two women. I don't like her spirit. We were on the cover of Ms. Magazine. Xena has no apologies. Xena is a really cool show. She was not only a hero, but she was flawed. She was not only dark and dramatic, but she was completely comedic. Above all the hot ladies with their leather outfits, ultimately the show is about learning to accept the life you lead and to be yourself. It sent their messages that we didn't even realize were there about empowerment and self-determination and friendship and courage. The show is so beloved by people. It's much more than a hookup. Renee O'Connor, get out here. They've created a family around the show and a whole bunch of new people, the second generation. From London, from New Zealand. They are what we call the hardcore nutballs. And, uh, and they're fantastic. You just have to really say that this is a really special group that we have here today. I got to meet Renee, best day of my life. I guess it's an inspirational thing. If I need that extra push, I will literally just think like, what would Zena do? Truly one person after the other says, thank you. My life has been changed by this show. It's a great story of overcoming obstacles both inside and out. Becoming the hero that's inside of all of us. It's a force for good. That's what's special about them. They're a force for good. And Xenites show up. Xena taught me how to be a good person, how to do the right thing, how to live with integrity.